Welcome back to Mommy Must Have. Today, we're gonna to be talking about convertible car seats. They get their name because they start off rear facing and then they convert to be forward facing. It's important to remember that the American Academy of Pediatrics recommends that all children rear face until they're two years old. The convertible car seat can be used from birth through about 60 or 70 pounds. Now, one thing that's really important to remember is that car seats actually expire. Many of them are made from plastic and over time they start to get brittle. So you want to check with your car seat manufacturer to see how long the car seat should be used. All car seats have basic safety features. They're all gonna meet the minimum guidelines. When you start to get into premium convertible car seats, you're really gonna see some revolutionary, some very innovative features. Some of them might feature steel bars or a completely steel frame. In the convertible market, I do recommend stretching as much as you possibly can because those extra additional safety features, they really can make a difference in an accident. Another thing to look for is a five-point harness. Pretty much all car seats today are gonna to feature the five-point harness, but what they do is they make sure that your child does not move in an accident. A lot of convertible car seats also feature additional safety features, for instance, some head support and other things. Again, you just wanna make sure your child is not moving in an accident. Another great safety feature on the convertible car seat is the tether. The tether is a strap on the back of a car seat, and what it does is it distributes any force from an accident from the car seat to the car. Now, not all car seats have a tether that can be used when you're rear facing. The Brightax models all have one, and for that reason, I really do recommend that you use them. The next topic is comfort. When you first start using the convertible car seat for a newborn, you're gonna be using the flattest lying position, and as the child grows, you're gonna move them into a more upright position. Now, it's just a matter of our busy lifestyles, but we really do spend a lot of time in our cars, so you want the car seat to be nice and comfortable for your child. Look for nice, plush padding, a comfortable material, but you also wanna make sure that just in case an accident happens, it is easy for you to clean. Now let's talk about convenience. As your child grows, you have to reposition the harness to make sure it's positioned correctly on your child's body. Some of the premium car seats allow you to just pull up on the harness to easily repositioning it, which is so much easier than having to rethread the harness. I highly recommend that feature in a convertible car seat. Another premium feature is the click and save technology that Brightex has, which makes an audible click every time you readjust the harness. Genius! Next is size. Convertible car seats can really range the gamut from slimmer to pretty wide. I love the additional safety features that the Brightax Advocate has, however it is a bit wide. You might not be able to fit more than two of those in the back seat of your car. So if you're planning on having a large family and need to get three across, you might want to consider a slimmer profile. For instance, the Diona Radian is a great car seat. Next up is travel. If you're planning on traveling, you might think that you're never gonna take that convertible car seat with you. Well, convertible car seats are fabulous to have on an airplane. Check with a car seat manufacturer to see if they're FAA approved. So what do I recommend? If you have a small budget, the Brightax Marathon is a great seat with lots of safety features. For a medium budget, the Brightax Boulevard has true side impact protection. And for a large budget, I love the Brightax Advocate. I actually own five of them. Also in the large budget category is the Diono Radian, which has a very slim profile so you can put three car seats across in your back seat. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you on the next episode of Mommy Must Have.